Wow. Doyle just sized up Sammy's chips, and when he looked over the chips, he looked about 15 years younger. <laughs> this hand has stirred up Doyle's interest. Right. Brunson looking down at pocket aces, oh, well, raised the $13,200. And Sammy Fahar has a perfect kind of hand for him, one of the types of hands he loves, H6 suited. He calls. You're winning every pot anyway. Right. Uh, the only way I can win is to bluff you. All right. And you know I bluff high. I don't bluff cheap. You know it, Doyle. I'm not going to check it, Sammy. You can't talk me into checking it. <laughs> okay. Here's the flop. A set so against the flush draw. <laughs> wow, and the talking had started before the hand. Okay. Doyle said he wasn't going to check, and he checks with three aces. Sammy bets his flush draw. Fifteen grand. He must think he can do it again. Wow. Doyle just sized up Sammy's chips, and when he looked over the chips, he looked about 15 years younger. <laughs> this hand has stirred up Doyle's interest. Right. And Brunson raises the $35,000. Very small raise, what? almost the minimum raise, a little more than the minimum raise. Now Sammy's aware that Doyle has check raised him, and he's just going to call. Putting the pot at nearly a hundred thousand dollars. Let's see if Sammy gets another flush. Turn cards a king of diamonds, so Brunson sets the leads. Doyle bet $60,000 in cash. Now, Sammy was cautious on the flop. The hand he's most afraid of is the ace of spades with another spade, which would mean that Sammy is drawing dead. I don't believe there's any way that Sammy's going to call here. We've seen this Sammy show before, where he's taken the maximum amount of time and thrown his hand away. I believe that's what he's doing here. And where is Sean Shiki when you need him? Say that again. Let's see, Lost Coin. And Sammy Lost coin. finally folds. <laughs>